In this video, we're gonna talk about the difference between achievers and non-achievers. You might know somebody that no matter what they do, no matter what they touch, it's a complete failure, no matter what it is. But then you might know somebody on the opposite side that no matter what they touch, it's almost like they have the Midas touch. Everything that they touch turns to go. Somehow it works out. Here's something that I want you to understand. The only difference between achievers and non-achievers is their response to failure. See, the one thing about achievers, they understand that failure is the price that you pay for progress. They understand that when you fail, there's something greater that you can get from it. There's some kind of way that you can get better from whatever you determine as failure. The other thing that determines achievers from non-achievers is how they define failure. Because when it comes to your failure, who defines it? You do. Nobody else can define your failure but you. So the one thing about the, those who achieve is that they redefine what failure is. They substitute failure for lessons. See, when you understand how to redefine failure and look at failure as a lesson, you think about it differently and you change your mindset about what failure is. Because what, what happens when you don't succeed in a lesson? You have to repeat it. So that's why you have people that fail over and over again versus people who achieve over and over again because failure has been redefined as a lesson. And if you don't pass the lesson, you have to repeat it. So in any circumstance that you're in and you don't get the results that you desire, think of it as a lesson and not failure. Because when you think about it as a lesson, you can think about, okay, what can I do differently to maximize to get a different result? Because the one thing about failure is that you understand failure when your actions change. Because people do the same action and they get the same result. So when it comes to achievers and non-achievers, one looks at it as the price that you pay for progress moving forward, and one looks at it as something that, that they failed in. They didn't achieve something, and they failed to learn the lesson. So I wanna encourage you, whenever you're in a situation that's unfavorable, don't think about it as failure. Think about it as a lesson going forward so that you can achieve and be that overachiever and overcomer to truly succeed in life and accomplish everything that you desire. This is Chris Cannon, your encouragement coach, reminding you that the battle is not lost unless you accept defeat.